Hi, Tanuki Bomb Squad. I am Tanuki Bomb or Kiki or Craig. That's my real name, if you want to call me that. <laughs> so what's this video about? I am chunky. I have day to day issues with my weight. It usually involves sore knees and ankles. I sweat a lot because I'm uncomfortable and I'm just tired of it. I'm really, really tired of it. So before we get into the main part of the video, I would absolutely love it if you could subscribe and like this video. At the moment, I'm sat shy of 100. So if we can get to more than 100 subscribers, that means I can have custom URL and like, you know, woo. So a lot of my time is spent sat down at a desk and playing games or editing videos. My issue is probably that I love food like i love food i would be eating all the time if i could so i need to combat it by doing more workouts and more physical exertion i started at my local gym in 2019 i started in january and i did february but then we know what happened like gyms were closed you can go outside i stopped going to the gym so now with everything opening up again and myself being double vaccinated, I feel, wait, get vaccinated. Don't be silly, get vaccinated, just do it, do it. You get cool guy points with me. My goal for this series, I haven't even come up with a name for it yet. What should we call this weekly workout vlog thing? Let me know in the comments. So to start with, I'm going to do the very dreaded thing which is to weigh myself on the scales and i'll do it nude because you know because of science <laughs> so i'm gonna go do that now as i was filming this i was really dreading that i'd accidentally just like catch my ween <laughs> in the shot just like a little cheeky view but no that wouldn't be very youtube friendly let's not do that 19 and three quarter stone for anybody who's not used to stone measurements, 19 stone is approximately 120 kilograms or 266 pounds. Or it's 1.207 E plus 8 milligram. I'm sure that's one that you wanted. It's just sad to be that heavy in like I can t I, I understand now why I have issues with my ankles and my knees. It's just a lot of weight that I need to shift. So hopefully from here, from now, I can start to go down. Someone just walked by and I'm still a little nervous when I'm vlogging. <laughs> hey, so it's Wednesday and this is one of my gym days. I think at the moment, because my body is so wrecked, that I'm only gonna be able to manage two, two days a week, if not three, because last time I went, I had a little bit of phone footage, which I can cut to in a minute, but I completely wrecked myself. I, I probably uh, prefaced my attempt at the gym by saying I'm gonna go too hard. Whenever I go to the gym or do any sort of exercise, I instantly go all out and then realize that my body can't keep up. Which I did. I went too hard and I injured myself. Uh, I'm dead. <laughs> but my first time basically highlighted just how unfit I am. I used to do like six different things, but I went last week and managed to do three of them. The kettlebell squats, slam ball, and I did my rowing machine. Anyway, I'm gonna go in, uh, so wish me luck. I'll report in when I'm done. I'm probably gonna be so miserable when I come out. I did it. Today, I managed to do everything on my list. So I did a sta stationary rowing, goblet squat, I did slam ball, chest press machine, I did seated rowing machine, 
and a cross trainer. The really cool thing about my app is that I get to log what I've done, how hard it was, and like what weights I was doing, so on and so forth. It's a great way for me to like track my progress to see how I get better, um, what I'm struggling with, and um, yeah, like what I need to work on. I'm fogging up the car. <laughs> So as I've been in the gym, Rachel has been learning Cornish, like the language. She's actually been learning the Cornish language. In lesson one, greetings, how are you? Who are you? Where do you live? Who is she or he? And numbers and maths. And then a couple of Cornish words that I don't know how to say. Perda, yen point, pointa, and splan, which means good. I know splan. So when we get home, I'm going to quiz her on these. So I was sent to go and get butter, deodorant, and here I am, where I belong. Ooh. How much are you? What I want to know is, who pissed off Mario? <laughs> What's wrong with him? He's just pissed that I'm not buying him. Back to the task at hand. Ooh, little Land Rover. <sighs> deodorant, deodorant. I'm hiding. Some old lady almost hit me with a trolley. Like legit, I almost died. Is that end of the news? I'm deodorant. <laughs> Now, because it's half seven at night and I've been a busy boy and I can't be bothered cooking, we're gonna have a Chinese tonight. So, yay for me for losing weight and I'm going to treat myself by having a Chinese, a succulent Chinese meal. <laughs> yes, you got beef, green pepper and black bean sauce, portion of chips, chicken fried rice, mini veg pancake rolls and a barbecue sauce. Yeah, that's everything, thanks. I'll be 18.50, I'll be ready in like 10 minutes. Brilliant. Thank okay, you. Thank you, bye. Bye. That's my order, what do you get? So whenever I turn home after a day of work, Nell gets really excited. Hello. Hello. Let me in. Hello. I'm on. So you have to tell me what you learnt in Cornish today. Why? You have to tell me now. I want to hear well, it. Well, I just reaffirmed some of the stuff I knew. Like, Wait. hello is Dista. Dista. So I'd say Dista and you'd say Dista. Dista. And then I'd say Fat Leganis, which is how are you, and you'd say... Fat Leganis? No, Fat Leganis. Fat Leganis. And how are you? You know this one. Splan! <laughs> Splan! Splan! I know Cornish better than you! <laughs> no, I taught you that. I'm home. I only learnt the numbers today, but I just remembered that five was pimp. I can't wait for you to be pimp. <laughs> you're, you're only one and a half, but when you're pimp, you're gonna be pimp. <laughs> it's my pimp birthday. <laughs> hey, welcome to my pimp birthday. I'm five. I got carrot cake. <laughs> We're gonna eat Chinese and watch Bake Off. Yeah. So I'll see you on Friday. Bye for now. Hey again, I'm back in the car outside the gym. It's Friday and I would rather be anywhere but here right now. I managed to uh, go a bit too hard and basically I've hurt my elbow. My entire arm is killing me. So what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna do about an hour and a bit on the bike and I'm gonna watch some Netflix. That's the reason why I signed up to the gym in the first place way back in 2019. So this is gonna be a really chill day. Good for my cardio, I suppose, but yeah. A 
sure way to tell I've done a workout is to look at the state of my shirt. Look at the state of it. Messy. So I did the bike for 65 minutes, did 700-ish, well like 650 towards 700 calories. And I watched two episodes of Sweet Tooth. Technically an episode and a half. Hello. How do you do? I'm okay, how do? I'm beginner. Oh, um, Dista. I said, how are you? And you went, hello. <laughs> um, Squith. Hi. Yeah, Squith. Hattie. Hello. I want pizza. I kinda want pizza. Let's get pizza. Alright, love you. Love you too. Bye. Bye. Time to drive home. It is 12 o'clock on a Saturday and we are going to a local Cornish language bookshop so I can maybe pick up a dictionary or some resources to help me learn Canuic, which is the Cornish language. It's closed. This is sad, right? Are there any other Cornish bookstores? That there's um, a Cornish bookshop in Falmouth, but I doubt you want to go all the way to Falmouth. I got my Apex time in, so we can go to Falmouth. Ooh. Got two wins. What's this, right? <laughs> the good thing about filming in Falmouth is because it's full of art students, I don't feel like this is out of place. <laughs> I feel like it's pretty normal. This is what you'd see in a Second attempt of trying to find some Cornish language books. We found Dr. Ken George's Cornish Dictionary, which is obviously a staple, and also War of Rav. Lots of phrases, lots of workbook related stuff, and basically just learning. So I'm looking forward to tucking into both of those. And now, I reckon, we're probably just gonna chill out for the rest of the day. I think so. What do you reckon? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. My yeah. Your butt. I wonder how these vlogs are gonna turn out. Nice. Will I even edit them? <laughs> if you're watching this, Craig did good. Pat on the back for Craig. Well done, me. <laughs> <laughs>